Hi, Mike's Carburetor Parts here. I'm going to explain how the power circuit works on a Holley 2245 two barrel, It'd be the same as a 2209 2210. Uh, we have basically a power jet right here. We have the power piston, which is right here. See how it moves up and down? And incidentally, it needs to move freely, not catch, okay? So you want to be sure it's clean. What happens at idle, you have full vacuum, and the vacuum is fed uh, through this passageway right here, through here, and uh, and incident, incidentally, while I'm showing you this, you could always, if, you, if the thing is frozen, you could drill this out, uh, get it cleaned out, punch it through, and uh, clean it out, and then... Uh, well, you'll have to size, You'll have to figure out what the diameter here is of this one, and uh, and we probably have these online. Um, anyhow, uh, get it cleaned out. Get it to uh, move smoothly. To take the power piston out, you just flick it like so. It breaks the uh, staking that I did. It has a spring on it. Yeah, and that's all there is to it. Now, um, if it's stuck in there, before you do anything else, just apply some heat here. Uh, almost 100% of the time, you'll be able to get it out when you, by just by applying heat. And then just clean out the hole real good with uh, carb cleaner or something like that. And, uh, okay, so I said, uh, to, told you that at idle you get your highest vacuum and it's pulling this piston all the way down. That, uh, this is what it sets on right here, your power jet. The stem sits on this little stem of the jet itself. And, like I say, at idle it's pulled up so your jet is fully closed so it does not allow fuel uh, to go... Uh, from the float bowl into the main system and as you lose vacuum or you get high speeds this thing will move down and depending on the RPM or depending on how fast you're going it pushes that stem down and allows uh, fuel to go from the float bowl and add fuel to the uh, main jet system okay and as simple as that so it's all about vacuum and it's all about making this uh, power valve loose enough in there because like I say only vacuum is what moves it. I'm going to put that back together. See this little washer goes on here. So when you put it in you just uh, take a, uh, a chisel and stake each side of this just a little bit. It doesn't take much. You just don't want it to fall out. And that's all there is to it. So, now, if you're having a rough idle, you might make sure this uh, power piston is not stuck open, or stuck where it's stuck down, I should say, where it's keeping the, your uh, main jet open. Or the main jet could possibly be leaking. Doesn't happen very often. Uh, just take it out and blow through the other end with the stem fully out and see if uh, you can blow through. If you do, it's, it's a bad one. Uh, they're just basically all brass. There's no rings or anything in it that to replace. So they pretty much will last forever as long as you get them clean. They're corroded. That's where you, when you have trouble. All right. Hope this helps. Thank you for watching.